territory. That way, we know if our liabilities exceed the stuff on hand and whether the cash or cashier is unbalanced and if depreciation is at up the moratorium and profit taken has weakened the capital structure and all stuff like that there. Now, we'll start with this showcase here. Write these items down. Yes. One revolver. One revolver. Is it loaded, please? Oh, okay. Yeah, it was loaded. <laughs> Look at Miss McGee, here come little old Indian, please, sir. Oh, maybe it's sitting bull on the hawk is easy chair. <laughs> Hi, Chief. Oh, you make loan on blanket? Oh, sure, we make plenty big loan on blanket. You make them blanket? Squaw make them. Oh, squaw, huh? Well, it's a very handsome way. Hey, this is a Persian rug. Hmm, plenty traveling men in pride. Mm. <laughs> well, I'll give you three dollars. You give them one dollar, not worth three dollars. Oh, honest engine, huh? No, honest, just foolish engine. Oh. Well, here's your dollar. Come in again. Hey, uh, what kind of an Indian are you, Chief? You Pawnee? No, me Pawner. You Pawnee. Well, come on, Phil. Let's get on with the inventory. Yes, sir. One lawnmower, one violin. There's a label inside of this fiddle. S-T-R-A-D. Stradivarius. Made in 1723. 1723. Shucks, a little that old can't be much good. <laughs> Throw that out, Phil. We'll just keep fresh stock in here from now on. <laughs> one camera. Sledgehammer. One small carpenter's plane. Wrap that plane up and send it to Edgar Bergen. Got in the box. Got in the car. He'll be old enough to shave one of these days. <laughs> Case. Hello there, Johnny! You the pawn shop man? That's me. Want to make a loan on something? What do you give me on this gold ring, Johnny? <laughs> take it off and let's see it. See? What's see? I says take it off and let's see it. Can't get it off, Johnny. But if you give me a loan on it, I'll stay here with it. <laughs> Dad Ratted Jr., if you have to stay here with it, what's the idea of getting along? <laughs> That's pretty good, Johnny. But that ain't the way I heard it. <laughs> Inventory. One accordion. You sell that to some ball players, Phil. They love those squeeze plays. <laughs> the way I hear it, Johnny. One fire saves to the other fella. See, says, I see where them three Albanian princesses has got orders to come home. Why, says the other fella. Well, he says, the homeboys are balking. <laughs> <laughs> Albanian princesses. <laughs> you know what an Albanian is, Phil? Yes, sir. That's somebody with pink eyes and white hair, please. Oh, no. <laughs> That's albumin. <laughs> Hi, Bob. Well, uh, what can I be doing for you today, my friend? Screwball Connolly sent me. Oh. You the boss here? Why, well, 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 yes, but what, well, no, no, I, I'm just taking care of this place while the owner's away. Don't give me that stuff. Huh? The mob left some stuff with Solomon to get rid of, see? They never paid off. Oh, dear. 5,000 bucks he's holding. I saw. Well, I didn't have nothing to do with it. Uh, what did he sell for you? Some hot ice. Hot ice? <laughs> <laughs> oh, quit your kidding, bud. <laughs> hot ice. <laughs> Sit down and I'll fry you an Eskimo pie. <laughs> <laughs> okay, white guy, laugh it off. But I'll be back later, see? Of all the dumb things. I mean ice pleasers. Huh? He means stolen diamonds pleasers. That's what they call hot ice. It is? Oh, well, that's just... Oh, well, I ain't responsible for Solomon's troubles. What's... Oh, it's Billy Mills. Hi, Billy. What you want? I want to redeem a pledge. What's the pledge? Well, I promised a couple of people we'd play whistle while you work. Oh, well, go ahead, Billy. Whistle while you work from So What and the Seven, etc. Oh. 